What's going on guys? So I finally decided to do it. I'm gonna go ahead and give this YouTube thing a try. It's about damn time. It's about damn time. So this is my first video and one of the questions I get asked the most is, what do I eat to stay lean? So today I'm gonna pretty much show you uh, kind of how I like to do things, how I like to do my nutrition, um, different supplements I take, and it's Sunday, so it's meal prep day. My awesome girlfriend, she's over there. But she does meal prep on Sunday, so you get to see some of that. Sometimes she meal preps for me, sometimes I do it myself throughout the week. Um, so we'll kind of do a little bit of both, kind of give you an idea of what I like to eat. Starting off, it's about a little bit after 8 a.m., so normally I wake up probably about 7.30. Usually start the day off with some type of my supplements here. Um, I like to do oats in the morning, so I'll probably do that after. I'm about to go on a run, so you'll see that too. Um, but first thing first, we're gonna get some Oxy Shred, the fat burner going, because I'm about to take Rachel, the dog, on a run. All right, guys, so I have all the goods that I like to put in there, starting off with the Oxy Shred. This is the one that only has 100 milligrams of caffeine. Um, around 100 milligrams of caffeine. I like to keep it on the lower end. So if you're interested in one that gets you a little bit more hyped up, you're gonna, gonna, you're gonna wanna go with the hardcore one. Also like to rock with some glutamine. And you know we have to get the creatine as well. You also need the joint repair. And just a little bit of Gatorade to help give it even more flavor. It doesn't need more flavor because it tastes awesome. I just like to mix some Gator in there and get some more carbs in there. Mix it all up. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish this. Then we're gonna go ahead and take Rachel on a run. When we get back, I'll show you how I like to make my oatmeal and then we'll go ahead and get on with the rest of the day. Rachel's gotta get her pre-workout in too. Oh no. Peep the shirt though. <laughs> Got Phoebe, Joey. How you doing? And Rachel. Oh. How is that, bud? Does it taste good? Hmm? You like peanut butter just like your daddy, huh? I think you got it all. No? <laughs> Still going? Okay, this video can't be an hour long, so we're gonna go ahead and go on the run. Man, someone really has to go to the bathroom. Sit. Good girl, wait. Okay. There's the pee. Now we just need her to go poop so she doesn't go during the run and I have to run around with the bag of poop. That's never cool. And... Let's go. All right, guys, like I was saying, we're about to hit this run. So usually I, I do this maybe three, four times a week. And honestly, it's more for her than for me. I don't really enjoy uh, running too much. I like to play basketball for my cardio. Um, I like to do more athletic activities like that. But currently in the state of our country, can't really just go show up to a gym and play basketball, unfortunately. So run about maybe uh, 15 minutes here and then go home, have some breakfast. So I'll catch you guys in about 15. Peace. Ready, Rachel? Let's go, come on. The meal number one, here we go. So I like to do oatmeal in the morning. And to be honest, most of my carbs actually come from oats and fruits. I don't really eat that much rice or sweet potatoes, potatoes. I like oatmeal, I like some granola. Um, I like fruit. So that's pretty much what I have every morning. Got my oatmeal, so right here, this is the oatmeal that I use. I like to have different flavors, so I have different types of that oatmeal. So I have like a blueberry one, uh, apple, cinnamon one. But I'm gonna go with just basic maple brown sugar this morning. I'm gonna go with two packs. This is pretty much my everyday breakfast, guys. I'm gonna toss in some uh, cashew butter. Gonna have myself an apple. Um, but yeah, got the oats in here. Going with the granola. Just a touch of granola, give it a little bit more texture, a little bit more flavor. So not too much, that's about it right there. And this is just the honey almond. 
right here. I like that one. Of course, we got to add in the protein. So I got my blessed protein here from EHP Labs. So we're going to toss that in there. Let's see. Oh, man. We are pretty much out. So this is the salted caramel. Um, so I'm just gonna dump whatever's left in here, not too much. And I'm actually gonna go ahead and uh, bust out the s'mores. So don't worry, we're still here. This is a plant-based protein. I go with plant-based just because uh, whey protein I actually have an allergic reaction to. So I stick with the plant-based. I used to have whey, but then somehow I developed a reaction to it. So if I wasn't allergic, maybe one day I won't be allergic anymore and I'll get back to having whey. But for now, I'm cool with the plant-based. And this from EHP Labs is bomb. I do prefer the salted caramel flavor, but the s'mores, this one here, also solid. And there's a couple other flavors too that I want to try. I haven't tried them yet. And voila, here is the finished product. I know it doesn't look that great, but trust me, if you have a good tasting protein, this right here is fire. Then I've got my apple and we're good to go. Crush that meal. Now I'm sitting here watching the Browns get their butt kicked. Right now it's 10 zeros in the first quarter. We still have a lot of life left, a lot of time to make something happen. As you can see, I got my Browns colors on. Forgot all of my Browns gear back in Ohio. So this is all I got, the colorway. But hey, let's go Browns. Let's get back in this game. Anyway, Erica and I are about to hit the grocery store, so we'll show you some of that and then get to meal prep. Thank you, you as well. What you got there? We got a pumpkin cream cold brew, no vanilla syrup. We are getting ready to meal prep. So we have caffeine to get us through, but it's exhausting. Meal prep is underway. Game time. Let's go. Speaking of game time, let's check out these Browns. See what they're looking like. Let's get back to the real show. All right, guys, meal prep is complete. Chef Erica hooked it up. So we've got some food here that's ready to rock and roll. Once we put it into some Tupperware, like this meal here, a ready to go meal. And then we have some things that aren't cooked yet, but we just prepared it so it's easier to cook throughout the week. It's looking awesome. We're all done with meal prep. Erica hooked it up, like I said. Now I'm gonna show you the three other meals that I like to eat during the day. You saw meal number one, which was the oats and the protein mix. I like to do three meals prepped, and then the last meal you'll see later tonight, um, which is also one I make pretty much every night. So normally what I do here for the three meals that we have prepped here, the, the structure and concept is the same. I'll have a meat, so here is chicken, I'll have a vegetable, this one has peas, and then I'll have a fruit, so something like an orange, um, kiwi, grapefruit, apple, whatever I'm feeling that day. And then I'll have some type of fat source, whether that's peanut butter, cashews, or avocado. Those are probably my, my favorite. I also will do um, a different type of mixed nuts. I really like pistachios as well. And then next meal, same concept, right? So we got the chicken, squash. I'll have a fruit with it. Last one, we got turkey here, asparagus. I'll have fruit, fat source. So I always have those three things or those four things. Protein, vegetable, fruit, 
and fat. It's already later in the day, so I'm not actually gonna eat all three of these meals today, but I'm gonna go ahead and smash one right now, and then I'll show you the last meal that I have tonight. Decided to go with the chicken, squash, cashews, and orange. Can't forget the hot sauce. Chicken's good. All right, guys, it's getting late here. It's about almost 11.30 here in California. So getting ready to wrap up the day with my last meal. This is what I normally would do. Um, if it sounds like I'm whispering, it's because I am. Erica's already asleep, so I'm trying to keep it on the down low. But we're gonna go with another protein mush mix. Um, gonna go two packs of blueberry oatmeal here, one scoop of our blessed plant-based protein, again with the s'mores. About one serving, actually probably two servings of peanut butter one serving of hemp seeds and then our frozen vegetables here what bro what are you talking about man yeah so these are not frozen vegetables frozen berries and yeah we'll mix it all up add a little bit of ooh, i forgot the almond milk yes i'm gonna go with a chocolate almond milk here because I like to feel satisfied at the end of the night. I like to have you know, a little bit of that sweet tooth craving satisfied. So let's go ahead and get after it. Yes. Check out the finished product. Ooh, wee, this is gonna taste so good. <sighs> All right, guys, that's a wrap. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. You got to see what I eat in a day. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, let me know in the comments below. This is my first YouTube video like this, so let me know how I did. Let me know if you liked it. Let me know what else you wanna see. And this is what they do at the end of a YouTube video, right? Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Yes, sir. Peace.